What's going on guys, my name is Ark and today I'm going to show you how to install custom Counter-Strike Source skins. So what you want to do is go to GameBanana.com, go to uh, Counter-Strike Source, click on Skins, and then click on a weapon you want. I'm doing the Glock because I think the default Glock is a little plain. So once you find a skin, uh, you'll be going through pages like this. You know, it has a bunch of different skins. I recommend the easier ones to install. So once you find a skin, click Download. Alright, you have to open it and then click Download. And then uh, if you don't Oh, okay. It seems I don't have to uh, wait for a uh, advertisement. Usually there's an advertisement like 30 to 20 seconds long. If you don't want to wait for the adver advertisement, just right click one of these download options, click open in, open link in new tab and it will start downloading immediately. So I'm going to open this up. Um, I always tend to do the readme text just in case they have extra stuff. Uh, it doesn't seem like they do, it just gives who did the sounds, the animations, the texture. Uh, and the model and the UV and the compile. Okay, so what you want to do is I'm going to close this out actually. Open your computer, go to local disk, go to program files, go all the way down until you see Steam, go to Steam apps, go to the folder common, then Counter Strike Source, then C Strike, and then Custom. Now, once you get in custom, you won't see this right here. See how it says my skin? Um, that actually won't be there. This will be empty. So, what you want to do is right click new and then folder for some reason my folder option isn't here anymore I have briefcase now I don't know what I did so once you create a new folder you can name it whatever you want open it and then uh, nothing will be in here this will be empty but I already have skins so that's why those are there so what you want to do is uh, everything fold that's foldered uh, if that makes any sense so like the readme and all these you you don't you don't need these for right here so what you want is to press control and click on sound models, materials, and you, you have to click on one and then click or hit control, pre hold control down, excuse me, and then click on everything else. Then just drag and drop it. And I already have a, a Glock skin. So um, if this comes up, if you already have a skin and uh, you want a new one, all you have to do is just hit this little box right here. It says do this for next conflict, do this for the next 13 conflicts, 14, so on and so on, whatever number it is. And then just hit move and replace. So now my old Glock skin is completely gone, and now I have this new one that I just downloaded, which is this one right here. So uh, that's it. That's all you got to do. Um, if you want more skins, um, all you got to do is just like click on it, download it, open it in uh, WinRAR, and then move and replace. So I uh, hope this helped, and I'll see you guys next time.